Oh no. You are related to Michelangelo. Oh dude, it's awesome. Oh, you want to be a Ninja Turtle? Yeah. I said certified free Seven days a week Wet and gushy Make that pullout game weak What's up everybody? Welcome back to the Cabin Dash Reaction Happy Monday everybody Okay you guys, Super Browser Logan I've done maybe one or two of his videos I think the last one I did was Jeffrey for President um, I'm starting to really like his videos SML movie So we're gonna watch the DNA test Let's get into this video. All right, guys, you ready to play superheroes? Oh yeah, dude, but I'm the Joker. I'm Batman. I wanna be Batman. No, Cody, I'm always Batman. Go be someone else, be Robin. I don't wanna be stupid, stinky, ugly, dumb Robin. Okay, well, then go choose someone, but you can't be Batman. Oh, oh Junior, you have another Batman. We can both be Batman. We both can can't be both be, you know. You yes, can't both be Batman. Yeah, to give the rules. Yeah, we can, I look. Hey, Batman, it's me, other Batman. No, you're mm -hmm. one of those dumb Batmans that work on Times Square. Mm -hmm. well, okay, Cody, look, we can both be Batman, but you're the uh, you're the Ben Affleck Batman. I'm Christian Bale. Well, I don't want to be Ben Affleck Batman. He was fat. Okay, well, then don't be Batman at all. Go be Mexican Superman. But, Junior, you always make me be Mexican Superman. Mexican Superman's the coolest. Yeah, Mexican Superman's awesome. Dude. Why is his hand so big? Stay right in time to make it to his daughter's quinceañera. Yeah, he's so awesome. Quinceañera. Let's get this over with. Okay. Hey, I'm the bad guy, Joker. You can't beat me, Batman. Oh, well, you don't understand who I have as my secret weapon. Oh! Come on, say your thing. Soy el Mexican Superman. <gasps> oh, no, not Mexican Superman with Batman. My two arch nemesis, I'm outnumbered. Yes, and you don't understand what he had up his sleeve. Say it. Hot plate. <gasps> not a hot plate. Oh, no, that's my weakness. Yeah, now hit him with the Baja Blast. <laughs> the Baja Blast. Oh, Baja Blast. Oh, I'm melting. I'm melting. And now you better get out of here before you get the Gordito Crunch. Oh, not the Gordito Crunch. Yay, we saved the day. Eva. All right. You want to watch TV or something? Oh, yeah. All right, let's watch TV. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hey there. Have you ever wondered if you were related to someone famous? Well, now you can find out. Just call me at 1-800-FAMOUS-DNA-TESTERS.COM. And I'll personally come to your house. Okay, There's not even a freaking phone number. To. You might even be related to Jeff Bezos. Maybe he owes you some money. Maybe maybe you're like a long lost kid of his. Or something. Come find out. Oh, guys, guys, guys. I want to get DNA tested. I want to see what famous person I'm related to. I don't know, Junior. That place looks like zero. A yeah, I want to get tested too. Uh, exactly. To Abraham Lincoln. Oh, that'd be so cool. I know, right? I bet I'm related to George Washington Carver. Ooh. Who's that? The guy who invented peanut butter, duh. Oh, well, why would you be related to him? Because he's smoother than peanut butter, duh. No. Who do, you, who do you think you're related to? A dork? <laughs> Dr. Dork? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, a Robert E. Dork? I'm <laughs> Dr. Dork Kava, y'all. Uh, Captain Dork? <laughs> dork I bet y'all know what it's from. Elon Musk, Musky Dork? <laughs> yeah. Dork, Dorky, Dorky? Yeah. I, Dorky? <laughs> My life as a teenage dork, bud? Yeah. These are just TV shows. Uh, uh, a dork and Josh? <laughs> Uh, I dorky. Oh man. Dorky. Okay. Uh, I'm not, dorks imaginary home for dorks. Yeah. No. Uh, uh, what's no. Uh, a cat dork. Uh, no. Dork? Uh, Just dork? stop. Uh, family dork. Just stop. Uh, a cinnamon toast dork. Uh, Rick and Dorky. Yeah. yeah. Uh, <laughs> a Rick and Dorky. Dorks? No. A bunch of dorks. Oh, ooh, ooh, uh, um, I got one. Uh, this, this is the dork wife of, of Zach and Dorky. Oh, no. No. Oh, no. Yeah, I'm trying to go way back. Oh uh, yeah, let's call a doctor so we get DNA tested. <laughs> hey there, somebody call a doctor to get DNA tested? Yeah, we saw the commercial and we want to do the test to see who we're related to. Oh, it's really fun. You never know who you'll be related to. Like I did it, and my great grandmother was Amelia Earhart. Really? Yeah, yeah. It explains why I'm so good at hide and seek and so bad at flying planes. So, so, so how do we do it? Well, you see wow. the DNA sample tubes? Yeah. Well, you There's no telling what she went. Fluid and put it in the tube. Okay, so like, I can spit in it? Yeah, sure, or whatever else. It doesn't really matter. Ooh, can I spit in it? Yeah, no! Sure. Yes. Right. I hope not! Yeah. Alright, so uh, after we put the stuff in there, then what happens? I right, just run it back to the lab, then I'll have your results by the next scene. Okay, I'm gonna spit in mine. It, it, it ain't that bad. Oh man, guys, I can't wait for our test results to be ready. Alright, your test results are ready. They're ready? Are they cool? Oh, they're cool. Alright, Cody, we're gonna start with you. The most famous person you're related to is Thomas Edison. Whoa, no way, dude! So sick. Who am I related to? You. You're related to Neil Armstrong. Neil Armstrong, the first man on the moon. I knew I knew a lot about space. Whoa, an astronaut, dude. Oh, I know it's so cool. Whoa. Okay, Joseph, you're related. Martin Luther King. Oh, oh man, I always knew I had a dream. I dream every night. No, no, not quite. But close. Osborne Dorsey. Uh, who's that? 
It's better off the doorknob. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. I'm always good with, you know, turning doorknobs. Yep, you have fun with that information. Oh, this is so cool! All right, guys. Can we just admit that I'm related to the coolest person ever? Neil frickin' Armstrong? No, Edison is cooler because he invented the light bulb. Without him, we'd be in the dark right now. No, because if Edison wouldn't have invented it, somebody else would have invented the light bulb. Dude, the only way you would have been able to get inside your house, Jay, I know, right? Because of my boy, Dorsey. Well, no, I know, no, right? You couldn't even open the door. What? Yes, we don't even need doorknobs. We don't even need him. See, 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 Neil Armstrong, he discovered the moon. He didn't discover the moon, Junior. He just went there. Yeah, and they say the first person to go on land discovered that land. So he was the first person on the moon. So he discovered the moon. And he got there with his cool spaceship. He flew there. No, he, landed, he didn't he discover the moon. And then he danced on the moon. Dude, he wouldn't be able to get out of his spaceship without a doorknob. Well, he wouldn't be able to get <laughs> out without a light bulb. Well, he, he wouldn't have been able to go to the moon if he would have discovered the moon in the first place. Dude, you use doorknobs for anything. No, no, you use light bulbs more. The light bulb in the doorknob is way like convenient than the man walking on the moon so so I would without think. the moon it would uh it would be it would be dark yeah without light bulb no without the moon we knew you wouldn't even know it was nighttime until you opened the doorknob well no 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 you would, you wouldn't know well, he could look out the window <laughs> he could look out the window so we don't even need the doorknob who cares but without doorknobs we wouldn't even have knock knock jokes ha, that's better or well, without light no. bulbs, you wouldn't even be able to see who's at the door to answer it well without without the moon you wouldn't know it was nighttime so you know not to answer the door because not scary people come at night or fans who don't know the rules <laughs> because so, scary people come at night and see without the moon we wouldn't have waves and without waves we wouldn't have ships that would bring you materials to make your stupid light bulbs and to make your stupid doorknobs so so actually you know what cody i'm suing you <laughs> i'm suing you because thomas edison got the idea for a light bulb by looking at the moon because he went outside and he said "Ooh, i like that little light in the sky Ooh, ooh i, I want to make one for my own so he made a light bulb based on the moon so i'm suing you yeah, yeah i'm suing you too cody because there's no way mr edison could make his light bulb without opening a door from mr dorsey yeah 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 yeah, yeah. See, see, see so cody you owe joseph money. well actually joseph you owe cody money because because without the light bulb dorsey wouldn't have been able to make a doorknob without light Nah, 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 nah. We had candles, bro. We had. Candles. Oh yeah, yeah. Candles. Ah, okay, so, he so said we had candles, bro. We had candles. <laughs> he could have did during daytime too. Dumb light bulbs, Cody. Well, okay. I'll just take away all the light bulbs in your house and see how you like it. We don't need them because we have the moon to light up everything. Nobody's gonna need doorknobs then. Yeah, we don't need that either because I just have a door. I just push the door open. I don't need a doorknob. That's dumb. I, I like Walmart automatic doors. Lazy. Nah, you don't no, want that, bro. I'll, I'll Not in this day and age. When y'all can't see at night. Oh, you don't want somebody just randomly coming in your house. It's gonna take forever to clean up. Wait, what happened to the lights? Oh, it must have been a power outage. Hey, hey Chef PP. Wait, C Cody, what are you doing? Uh, do you know if there are any more light bulbs in the house? Wait, wait, wait. Why are you stealing our light bulbs? Oh, I'm not stealing these. I own these. My great great grandfather was Thomas Edison. Look, I don't care who your great grandfather is. <laughs> my light bulbs back. Tell that to Junior. He thinks Thomas Edison didn't do anything. What? Mm -hmm. Look, my light bulbs back! And done. I just finished my Apollo 11 Lego sculpture. So I'm just like my great great grandfather, Neil Armstrong. What, what happened to the lights? Yeah. Hey, Junior. What are you doing here, Cody? Well, I'm just making all y'all think. My light bulbs that my great great grandfather invented. Wait, wait, you stole my light bulbs? Oh, I'm not stealing them. Since my great great grandfather invented them, they're mine. Well, well, I was building my Apollo 11 Lego sculpture. See, look, there's me, and there's my great grandfather. But you ain't got no patent on it. I didn't see any light bulbs on the Apollo 11. Yeah, that's great. Well, I'm going to just take all of these light bulbs back to my house where I'll have all the light. Well, well, when you're walking home, guess what's going to help you light up the streets when you get home? Uh, the moon. Well, there are also street lights. And guess what's in those street lights? Light bulbs! <laughs> well, you're dumb and, and stupid. Man, I'm so glad whoever invented the goddamn street light, I forgot who did it. You're going home. Home? Where? Through this door? You know you gotta use this circular thing. What's it called again? A doorknob. Can I please use the doorknob? I guess so. For a thousand dollars, and if you praise my great granddad Dorsey. Well, I don't have a thousand dollars. Well, get an appraisal. Hey, Cody, bring me back my light bulbs. Oh, now you want them. I thought they were useless. Well, they are useless, but I bought them, so they're technically mine now. <laughs> I forgot one. Hold on. Well, the, Cody, don't, mm -hmm. grab that don't do it. Oh, come on, Cody. Well, well, at least you can't get through this door. Oh, uh, yeah. Okay, Junior, I'm going out your window. Well, well, uh, Panting! So, so where are you going now, Cody? I'm going home. Well, oh, but they invented windows. If you ever look up at the moon, 
when you owe me a hundred dollars. Okay, fine. I don't want to look at the moon. I've seen it before. You better not ever look up. Don't look up. I'm not. Don't look up. Junior, I'm not looking at the moon. You better not look up. <sighs> Junior, are you gonna follow me all the way home? Yeah, because I don't want you to look up at the moon because that's my moon. That's my great grandfather's really? moon. You can't look at it. If you look at it, you owe me a hundred dollars. I'm not gonna look at it. Don't look at it. <laughs> Don't look at oh my god, Pooty, like if there was a time to look at it, you should look at it now. It's the most beautiful full moon in the world right now. Oh, oh Pooty, look, there's a man on the moon. You know, there's no man on the moon. There was my great grandfather Neil Armstrong. He was on the moon. That was the man on the moon. The only man on the moon. And that dude talks a lot. You gotta look at it. You owe me a hundred dollars. Junior, shut up. It's the most I know, right? Man in the world. Like, if you want to look at it, you can pay me a hundred dollars. I don't care, Junior. Like this walk home would be so boring. He must be I'm really different. Desperate, big, big desperate for a hundred dollars. I'm not looking at it. But, but, but you better not look at it. You better one hundred. I give you one hundred. Are you sure? Yeah. So pretty. Okay, I'll let you look at it one time. No. I'll let you, free, for free. You can look at it one time. No, I don't even want to now. Look at it for free, like one time. Shut up, Junior. Go away. Junior, you broke all my light bulbs. Well, they technically want your light bulbs. Bro, wait, 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 wait. Junior, Besides all that, how they free? Are they going to clean it up? It's dark. I wonder if I buy them. I'll sell you a piece of the moon. How about that? No, Junior, I don't care. I don't want to see you right now. Well, no, I'll, I'll sell you one piece of the moon if you start getting mad. God, I can't stand Junior. I, I, where do you think you're going, Cody? In my house. Oh, in your house? Don't you think you have to use a doorknob? Well, well yeah, but jo Joseph, this is ridiculous. This is my house. But this is my doorknob. A doorknob. <laughs> Look at it, look at it. But this is my doorknob. <laughs> Get the climbing. This is my doorknob. <laughs> I'm just going to sit on my couch. With no what would y'all great great grandfathers think of y'all? Think of that, which I don't. Just, the, the roof is blocking the moon. But I don't need stupid dumb light bulbs. They're dumb. Hey, uh, wait, why is it so dark in here? Oh, my friend's great-great-grandfather was, uh, uh, the inventor of light bulbs, so he took all my light bulbs. Oh, yeah, about that. I have an important update about your DNA test results. Uh, can you get your friends back here? No, fake. I try, but they're really mad at me. Yeah, uh, just so you know, there's also a guy who's over by your front door charging people a thousand dollars to use his doorknob. That's Joseph. Joseph, get up here! Get Cody! What is it, Junior? The doctor says he has to tell us something. What do you want, dude? Cody, can we please have a light bulb just while you're here? Okay, but you only get one. All right, doctor, what'd you have to tell us? Well, uh, it looks like the test results I gave you before were wrong. Wrong? Wait, I'm not related to Neil Armstrong? No. Well, well, well Cody's not really related to Thomas Edison? Nope. Well, well Joseph's not related to Dorsey? No. Well, then who are we related to? Well, I got your real test results right here. Oh, no. You are related to Michelangelo. Oh, dude, it's awesome! Yeah. I already lived in sewers. <laughs> yeah, and Junior, you are related to Crush from Finding Nemo. I mean, that's still pretty cool. Like, what's up, Jelly Man? What's he up, really, he got to do something like Crush. He sound like Crush. You, Cody, are related to Vern from Over the Head. Vern. <laughs> <laughs> Vern? Nah. Over the head. <laughs> I y'all related to Turtles? <laughs> Oh y'all related. Do we even have to discuss who's related to the Oh uh, y'all related to Turtles. Dude, it's me. I'm a ninja. No, it's me. He rode the East Australian current. No one else did that. Well I went totally. <laughs> they all good turtles. The yeah, but leave it my alone. Leave it now. Really? <laughs> that was funny. SML movie the DNA test. Well, it looks like in the end, all of them are related because they're all turtles. Um, I didn't know the last dude on the end was a turtle, though. The one that looked like a wizard. I didn't know he was a turtle. But yeah, um, guys, speaking of stars and moons and stuff, I hope you guys had a chance to see, uh, what was it? Jupiter and Saturn. I don't know which day it was. I think it was before Christmas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Christmas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I might be on Wednesday. But Saturn and Jupiter. I got a picture of it and it was going like back, y'all. But yeah, won't be here again for the thousand years, so we'd all be gone. But anyway, you guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this SML movie, the DNA test. I'm really enjoying these SML movies by Supervisor Logan. If you guys want me to watch some more Supervisor Logan, smash that thumbs up boy. Um, don't forget to leave a comment down below. up comment share and subscribe push that bell to be notified when the next video drops welcome all new subscribers to the kbx crew this has been another mission completion and i'm out